into my unboxing of Victon's eighth mini album, Choice. As you can see, I did buy quite a lot of copies of the album in various formats. So we have two of the regular edition albums, we have three platforms, and we have a full member set for the Digipacks. Now, the reason that I did this was because I collect three members, so I decided to get three platforms, that way I would have enough to trade for the members that I collect, give or take. The Digipacks though, I got a full member set because once again, I collect three members, so if I just got three at random, you know, sure the chances are high that I'll get at least one or two of the people that I collect, but you know, I'd like to get all three. So in order to make that chance 100%, I got a full member set. Um, but the two members that I don't collect, I'll obviously be putting up for sale. My roommate or my old roommate, oh, it's so sad to say that, my old roommate Jesse um, has already claimed my Subin copy, so that'll be going to him. So I'll probably just have Young Chance to to sell and or use to trade, so that's fine. One thing though that is actually pretty hilarious and I'm kind of slapping myself for is I may have accidentally bought a second set. This was not intentional. So on K-Town For You, you could buy a, like, I guess they call it a set. And for some reason, my brain thought I needed to put two in there so that I would get one of each version. But really that meant I bought two sets. So I have four copies, which, you know, it doesn't hurt because I do collect three members, like I said. So the more photo cards I get, the better. I'm just kind of annoyed because I really didn't want two extra copies, but I'll figure out something to do with them. So anyways, I think we're just going to start with the regular copies. So I'm going to move the platforms and digipacks out of the way. And some of you might be wondering, how do you know you have a full member set? They're labeled on the back with the names. So we'll get to that when we get to that. So firstly, let's start with the regular versions of the album. What are the version names? I don't remember, but I will check. Oh, they're the time and free version. I don't remember which is which though, but that's okay. So anyways, let's look at the track list first before I even take it out of the plastic. The title track virus is phenomenal. I love it, but I think my favorite song is probably Alive. I don't know, when Hansei started rapping on that track, I was like, ooh, yes, this is for me. But the whole album is great. I love it. Obviously, Victon are one of my old groups, so I'll probably like anything that they drop because I'm biased. I'm kidding. I'm not afraid to say if I don't like something, but I do genuinely love this title track and this album. So anyways, here's the front and the spine. We're just going to call it the orange version for now, but it's either time or free. Oh, it's time. It is the time version. So here we go. Let's just get this off. So it's just a little slip cover box. Oops. Oh, the CD is there. I touched it and was like, what is that feeling? So we have the CD right there in the lid, which is nice. I kind of like that. And then we have our booklet. I don't know if the photo cards are going to be underneath it. So let's find out. This might be edited down. They are not there. Are they in this book? They look like they might be in this book. I don't know. Is this? Okay, yes. Oh, maybe they're in this envelope. And then this, I think, is just a little insert. I'm pretty sure it's just a little insert. Yeah, I'm not even going to take it out. So that's that. Here we go. Oh, I was like, why is it smaller? Obviously, this needs to be slightly bigger to fit over top. Anyway, let me just make sure there's nothing in this booklet before we go through it. I feel like there might be. No, I don't think there is actually. So here we go. I don't know. I'll probably do like a quicker flip through just because we have a lot to get through today. But oh man, when this picture of Sinshik dropped on Twitter, I just about lost it. So yes, I love the color schemes going on in here. The like orange and blues obviously goes with the album cover concepts. Oh, we have some greens for Hansi. Oops, sorry. And then we have some yellowy chartreuse colors for Byung Chan and some purples for Suvin. Love his hair, his comeback. It suits him so much. And there we have everyone. And then we move on to the next concept, which, oof, look at Sungshik, my bias. For those who don't know, I do collect Sungshik, Sejun, and Hansei. So, yes. 
Everyone looks so good this comeback. Oh my god. Look at him. Look at Hanse. Oh my gosh. Such a talented rapper. Please, if you have not checked out their music, do so now. Especially the song Alive on this album. And just listen to him rap and have a great time. Anyways, here we have this little envelope. And I think this is where all my pulls are going to be. So let's start with some of the larger ones here. We have a little four cut photo thing. And we have Hanse. So there's one of my biases in larger inclusions. I don't trade or anything for larger inclusions anymore, so when I pull my biases, that's always great. And then we have, oh, we have another one of my biases in the larger inclusions. So we have Sejin here in the little, um, like, pop-up card thing. I'm not sure what the actual term is for this, but there he is. Ooh, two of my biases already starting off strong. And now I think it's, oh no, there's that uh, puzzle piece thing, this thing that's been a, uh, a constant in this trilogy of albums. As you can see, this is three of three. But yes, love that. I love the colors going on in this album. It's just so bright. Okay, and then we have, I think, yeah, just a few photo cards in here. We're just gonna pull them out really quick. Now I saw that um, you're supposed to get two photo cards plus a pre-order, but I think they've made a mistake or they lied or something because everyone's just been getting one. Now, I don't know. I thought I saw something on Twitter about like some sort of form you could fill out and they'd send you a photo card or something. I don't know, but I think it was in Korean. I don't remember what I saw. Anyways, let's look at this first photo card. I think this is, oh, it has a name on it. Huh. Well, we have Young Chan, but I think this might be the pre-order benefit card and there he is so cute and then yeah we only have one other photo card here and i'm going to cover the back because this one probably has a signature all right who do we got one two three oh and we got sungshik he's a little scuff no he's not it's just a little speck oh my gosh we got my first sungshik pull that is so exciting for me as you know he is my top bias and one of my alt uh alta vaults i guess you could say so yes oh my gosh love this card so cute but yeah it's kind of sad that we're not getting two cards in the album like we thought we were so now i am kind of happy i got those two extra copies but at the same time i don't know i could have had even more photo cards right so anyway we're gonna keep those in there we'll take we'll keep these guys out since i'm going to be trading and whatever putting them away in my binder so there we go that is the what did i say it was the time 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 version so we're gonna set this aside and then we'll open up the free version okay so next up we have the free version so let's get this out of the plastic here we go oh wait let's look first so here this one says free and it's obviously a more baby blue, dusty blue, I don't know. And there's the track list on the back. So let's just get this out of the box. Oh, and then yes, I forgot the CD is right here in the lid. Always love that. And then we have the photo book and the little envelope of goodies. So I'll leave that over there and we can look through this photo book. I love the outdoorsy concept of this one. Always love a good outdoorsy photo shoot. And again, I'm just gonna kind of do quick flip throughs. Oh my gosh, he looks so good. He always does, but uh, love him. Then we have Sejun. And Byung-chan, oh, what a cute photo. I love that one. Oops, kind of skipping some pages by accident, but that's okay. Ah, oh, these two together, I love it. I love it. I also love that Hansei's tattoos always like peek out no matter what he's wearing and I love that for him. Oh, and he, Subin, just looks so ethereal. Like a little fairy prince. Love it. Oh, and then we go back into this concept, which is this the exact same as the other one? So is the first half of the book the exact same or are these photos, like the concept is the same here, but were these photos the exact same? I don't remember. We can do a little compare and contrast later, maybe if I feel like it, but we have a lot to go through, so I probably won't do it on camera, but maybe I'll update you down below if it is the same. I can't remember. 
Anyways, again, we have this little envelope. This time, obviously, it's blue. So let's start again. Oh, no. Where's the four cut photo? Uh, did I not get one? Oh, it's a key ring thing this time. Okay, so we're going to start with this. So we got Sejun again. So I have two little Sejun pop-up card things now. That's exciting. Now let me see if I can get to that key ring thing. I saw the string when I took a little peek. Oh, well, I found the puzzle. So we'll look at that as well. So there is that. And then, okay, I'm going to do this off camera so you guys don't see the photo cards at all. I'm not even looking at the photo cards, but okay. So we have this little key ring and oh, we got Hansei. So we got Hansei's four cut and then Hansei's key ring. And then we got two Sejun pop-up cards. Interesting how my biases are coming for me in the non-photo card inclusions. Okay, took the photo cards out real quick. So let's start with, I think I got them all right. Yeah, so there's still two, only two this time, but that's okay. So again, we'll start with the um, pre-order benefit one and I'm covering the name. Who did we get? One, two, three. Oh, we got another Sungshik. Oh my gosh. I love when I pull his cards because recently at least he's been a little difficult. I mean, I'm up to date other than the one card that like doesn't exist. I will once again pop that up on the screen or you can check my Instagram, check my priority highlight. I am looking for that card and I cannot find it. So if you in any way, shape or form can help, I would be greatly appreciative. And then lastly, we have the selfie photo card and we got one, two, three. We got Supin. Oh, what a cute card. So Jesse, my former roommate, is collecting Subin this era. I need to sneeze, I think. Maybe. Maybe not. Nothing came out. But yes, so I will probably be holding on to this for him. I don't know if he's getting the regular versions of the album. Like I said, I am going to give him the Subin Digi pack that I got. But yeah, so there is that. So we're just going to pop the larger inclusions again back into the album. Oop, Hansei fell. There he is. So there is that. And now we can quickly open the extra copies that I bought by accident. And we'll just be looking at these two for pulls. I'm not going to do like obviously a full unboxing again because what would be the point? So here is the free version. It's very possible that it'll be an exact dupe who knows let's find out so for the key ring it is Hansei again for the four cut card it is Sejun again for the oh the puzzle is obviously gonna be the same for the photo cards it is a duplicate set so we have Sungshik and Subin once again so I figured it might be a dupe set we'll keep those out but yeah it is what it is like i said i didn't even mean to buy these albums so i will just use those cards as trade bait and then we can open the what version i always forget time time version and see what our extra pulls are here again very well could be a duplicate album but we'll find out together here we go All right, moment of truth. Oh, this is a different color. So we have a Subin four cut photo. We got Hansei's before. And then for this, oh, we got Subin's and we got Sejun's before. I love that purple color, by the way. It's so good. And then for the photo cards, oh, we still did get Sing Shake again. So that was the same. And oh, oh, this is different. So we got a Hansei pre order benefit. So that's nice. Before we got, who did we get? Was it Byung-chan? I think we got Byung-chan before. So that is exciting for me. And then the puzzle again. So, hey, it was a little different. We got a double Sungshik. Never going to be mad about that. But yeah, so cool. All right, let's close that up. We'll move these photo cards out of the way. And whoops. And we can look at, let's look at the digi packs next. Okay, so next up we have all five member versions for the digipacks. I believe each member version you get that member's 
pulls, at least that's how it was in the previous era. So I didn't put these in any particular order. We're starting with Sunshik, it seems. And excuse me if it takes me a little longer to read Korean. My reading skills are a little slow, but we'll try. Anyways, so we're starting with my top bias, which is always exciting. I'm kind of sad they're not member covers, but unless the slip cover might be. No, oh, oh, the inside is. Oh, that's so much nicer. I mean, I love the black, don't get me wrong, but. Ah, okay, so this is what the little slip cover bit looks like. So there is that, but I love the member cover. I might just have to display it like that instead. So anyways, in one side we, oh wait, hold on. Yeah, in one side we have the CD. Oh, it's a, is it a member CD plate too? Oh my gosh, I can't open it. It is a member CD plate. So we have some chick there. I'm just going to leave it out for a second. And then when you open it up, we have more photos of him, obviously. But we also have a little mini poster. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, gorgeous. I think it's the same. Yes, it's the same as the front cover. So there is that. And then we have the little booklet, which probably... Oh, my photo cards are in there still. Ooh, oh no, it's bent. That's okay. So anyways, should just all be photos of Sunshik, I believe. It's actually got quite a few pages. So if you've opted to get the digi packs instead of the full album version, you still get quite a lot of photos and it'll be of your bias only, which is always nice. And then you have the lyrics. So there is that. And then we can look at the photo cards. It looks like there's three in here maybe. Ooh, there is. Okay, so we'll start with this one, which I think might be the pre-order benefit one because it has the same kind of it's focusing on his face um it has the same kind of imagery on the back so oh you do not get your members or your biases photo cards so keep that in mind but we got sejun which is great for me because i do collect sejun and that is a beautiful photo card so there is that then next up we have this one here and oh it's a group card now i believe you always get a group card i guess we'll find out when i open the rest but there is that super cute and that's what the back looks like and then lastly we do have a sungshik card i recognize his signature and that card looks like this it's so cute it kind of almost looks like the other one that i pulled ish not really actually i lied to you but this is an adorable photo card oh my god i love it so much so there we go that was the sungshik version and uh, i guess we'll find out in a second who we have next i'm just going to clean this up a little bit Okay, so let's see who we have next. Next up, we have Subin's Digipack. So this one is eventually going to go to my roommate. I think I'm probably going to keep the photo cards for myself, though. I think that's what we had discussed. That way I will be able to trade. But let's quickly take... Oh, the poster fell out. But there we go. So here is his little cover. I'm not going to show this again because we've all seen it. And then when you open it up, and that's what it looks like so let's look at his poster first it should be the same as the front cover yes it is cute and we can look at his cd plate there it is beautiful and then his little booklet let's make sure all the photo cards fall in there i think they have so there's the front cover and now we can look at his photos so yes like i said love his hair and overall look this era he looks so good sorry if you can hear somebody talking i think my neighbor is out on their balcony but <laughs> yes there he is super cute whoa i'm so sorry about that so there's his little booklet and now we can look at his three photo cards well not his technically we'll see we're, we're gonna hide that signature but first let's look at the pre-order benefit card and we got oh we got a byung chan with his whole chest showing so that's always fun um but there he is oh my gosh if i drop one more thing how i'm never gonna be able to get that with my nails there we go so there's byung chan then we have this card over here and it is the group card now is it the same yes it is i can kind of compare subin over there so this is the exact same group card i don't know if there is more than one but i guess we'll find out 
And then lastly, ooh, we got a Subian photo card. So it looks like maybe the selfie is always the member specific card, but the pre-order benefit might be somebody else. That's what's happening so far. But oh my gosh, look at how cute he is. Ugh, I can't even. Adorable. So there is Subin's. Again, I'm just going to clean this up really quickly and we can move on to the next member. Okay, so next up over here, we have Hansei's version of the Digipack. Very excited about this. So let's take a quick look. Also, I don't know if I mentioned, but I did order everything from K-Town for you. I don't think I said that, but anyway, here is his front cover. Oh, he looks so good. And there's the inside and the back. Now let's look at his poster first really quickly. Again, it'll be the exact same as the front cover, but there it is. Just a little more zoomed out. And then his CD plate looks like this. Oh, I love that photo. So good. And then his little booklet. There's the front. And here's the photos. So, ugh. Oh. Such a handsome, handsome man. Ugh, and like I said, his wrapping is just next level. So underappreciated, in my opinion. So there's his little photo book. And then we have photo cards. So let's take a quick look. Now we'll look at this one first, which is the random member, maybe potentially. Oh no, it's the group. Oh, and it's different. It is different. So there's at least two. I'm sure it said in the like album details how many different ones there were, but I don't remember. So far, there's two. This was whatever the random. Oh, but there's a name. I forgot. Well, well, <laughs> we got Sinshik. Oh, that's so exciting for me. Oh my God. He looks so good. I love him so much. So there is that. And then lastly, this one does have a signature, so I'm going to try and cover it. I saw it, but I don't think I remember whose signature that is, but I think I might have an idea. Let's see. My guess is Sejun? No, it's Hansei's. Oops. Oh, yeah. I forgot. We do get the one. Anyways, <laughs> the signature card is always, at least so far, always the member on the cover. So we did get Hansei's little signature card, which is very exciting. So there is that. Again, going to clean this up. And we'll look at the last two. Okay, so next up we have Sejun's album. So that's exciting. We're on the last of my biases that we'll be opening up. And then last we'll have Byung-chan's version of the album. So here we go. Ooh, so handsome. Handsome as always. Oh wait, let's look at the cover first. So there he is. Oh yes, such a handsome, handsome man. And there's the inside. There we go. And then the poster. There he is. Beautiful. CD plate. So jammed in there. There we go. Oh, he like avoided the little circle. <laughs> so there's that. And then his booklet. There we go. There's the front. And there we go. Beautiful. Look at that jawline. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at him. Quite literally a visual. So beautiful. For those who don't know, fun fact, he was the member that stood out to me first. And before I collected three people, before Victon became an ult of mine, Sejun was actually the member that I collected. Like, only him. And then I was like, wait a minute, Sungshik's my bias. But I still want to collect Sejun, so I collected both. And then Hansei happened, so... <laughs> There's that. And then we have the three photo cards. So this was the group card, right? Yes. And this is the same as the first two that we got. So there's that. And then for the pre-order benefit, I'm going to cover the name this time. And we got, oh, we got Pyeongchan. We have this one already, but that's okay. There he is. Super cute. And then for Sejun selfie card, I assume, yes. So yeah, you definitely get at least the signature slash selfie card for the member that you got on the cover so there's Sejun it looks phenomenal so 
yes we'll clean this up and we'll move on to young chan okay and last but not least we have young chan so let's take a look at his it's been really fun opening every single member. I did the same for SF9 because again there was only six members for their recent release and I collect three so I just got the full set and it was really fun to unbox all of them and I'm having a great time again here so here is Young Chan's cover and then the inside. Oh, I love these type of like high-waisted corset tuxedo style pants. I don't know what they're actually called but I saw a similar style on Zara's website and they called them corset pants so I don't know. Oh, look at him. Looks phenomenal. So there's that. His CD plate. Probably the easiest one to get out, but there he is. Beautiful. And then his booklet. Here it is. Ooh, great front cover. Yeah, I just really like this outfit on him. The high-waisted pants and like the exposed chest open collar. It really works for him. His height too, like with the corset pants, I feel like it accentuates how long his legs are even further, if that makes sense. I don't know, it just makes him look long, longer than he already is. So there's that beautiful booklet. And then we can look at the polls. So let's see what we've got. Group card first. And we got the same as the first one. So we have two different versions of the group card. If there's only two, we did well. If there's more than two, well, I don't really think I'm going to trade, but whatever, we'll find out. And then for the pre-order benefit card, we got Young Jen again. So this is the third time we've got this card. So I think the only pre-order benefit I'm missing is Hanse. So I will try and trade for one of his. And then for Young Chan's signature selfie card, we got... oh this one he's so cute look at that oh my god I love it so much so yes that was all five of the digipack versions of the album but we do still have three platform <laughs> albums to go through so let's get right on into it Okay, so last but not least, we have the three platform versions of the album. There's a high chance these will all be duplicates. I know that happens with K-Town for you, so wish me luck. But we have the track list on the back, and the front has a little, what is ever, whatever this is called, a little clasp, I don't know. I'm going to pop this open. We're probably going to see right away who I got, but that's okay. Oh, okay. So I'm not going to flip this over because it will have a code on the back, but we got Sejun's PVC card, which is so exciting. I hate trading for these because they're so thick. So glad that I pulled them. And then of course we've got Byung-chan. Byung-chan loves me like a lot. So we have this. These cards feel a little flimsy, like really flimsy in comparison to a standard photo card, which is interesting, but there's the back. It's a nice bright orange. And then we have another one, and it is Subin, and it has this blue back instead. So I guess maybe you get one orange, one blue. I guess we'll find out. But um, yeah, very happy to have pulled a Sejun, um PVC card. So this is what it looks like on the inside, on the back. And then we have this little accordion book, which is always nice. You still get a little bit of every member if this is the option for the album that you chose. So there's that, and then on the back we have all of the lyrics. So there we go. These will be really quick to go through because there's not a lot to them, which is nice. These are like the eco-friendly version of buying multiple albums. So I'm glad K-pop companies are kind of doing this, but the problem is there's so many different versions of the album, and if you want to collect all the photo cards, you're kind of almost creating more waste because people are not gonna well most people like me for example who collect everything for Victon are not gonna just choose one you know so I don't know it's a bit hit or miss but here we go next platform will it be a dupe let's find out together pvc is oh we have Hansei's pvc so we're two for two we also got a sejun photo card. This one has an orange back, so that's exciting. And then we have a Byung-chan card, because of course we do, and this one has the blue back. Now I don't know if any of these were supposed to be like a 
pre-order benefit or if they were all just whatever but very happy to have this and then this is going to be the exact same so not going to go through that again so that was an exciting one we're getting a lot of sejun we got hansei pvc will sungshik avoid me probably <laughs> but let's find out in the final album we're opening in this video will we get a sungshik let's see oh oh it's a dupe it's a dupe no that's okay i knew that there was a high chance of that happening so i will probably try and trade one of these hanseis for a sunjik platform and then same goes for any extra photo cards that you see here that are not my top three you can check out my instagram and i will definitely have these up for trader sale very soon if they're not already up there one thing i did forget to share though is we also got k-town for you pre-order benefits and we only got them for the regular albums that i purchased and remember i accidentally bought four instead of two so we have four k-town for you pre-order benefits here the first one being sejun so that's great however i only collect sungshik pre-order benefits now um I don't know, maybe I can find a way to work in all three of my biases if I feel like it. We'll see how my binder layout works out. But the second one we got here is Sungshik. Oh my gosh, such a cute card. I'm so happy to have both of those. And then secondly, we have Zubin. So I'll probably actually save this one for my roommate and I will give that to him with his Digipack album. And then lastly, we got Myeongchan. So the only one I didn't get was Hansei. Will I try and trade for him? I don't know. If I do find a way to like put them in my binder in a way, maybe, but it's, I don't need it. So anyways, do I dare pull everything back into frame? I don't know that I'm gonna have room for it, but we'll try. And there we have it. It's a little messy. It was kind of hard to fit everything. Obviously there's more photo cards than this that came out of here. Oh, and we have the K-Town for you benefits, but that was a lot of unboxing oh my goodness this video is going to be probably one of the longer unboxings or the longest unboxings i've ever posted on this channel that's just my guess i honestly don't know but oh my gosh we did pretty well i'm very excited for my pulls and to start trading and collecting this new era it's always fun for me to collect victim except for when certain cards don't exist but anyways um i hope you enjoyed this unboxing and i will see you in the next one Bye-bye.